All right, guys. My name is Ojeni Ayobami. I've been Bola. Um, today, I want to share very vital information with you. Okay, I'm going to be talking about nine skills that you need to have as a crypto trader. Okay, so I consider these skills highly valuable and very important. Okay, to your journey if you want to become a successful trader. So, but before I proceed on that, I would like to invite you to the Crypto Next channel. Okay, I want you to subscribe to the channel now and turn on your notification bell. Okay, so that when next I go live, okay, when next I, I upload a video, you are going to be notified as fast as possible. You'll be among the first people that will watch it and they will never be able to miss out again on all of this valuable content. So if you look at this chat, if you look at this channel now, there are dozens of videos that will help you jumpstart your career in the cryptocurrency and blockchain industry. Okay. So there is a robust playlist for you, you know. So just make sure you subscribe to the channel and turn on your notification bell. So let's go back to this now. Um, one of the most important skills for a trader is pattern recognition. Okay, you need to be able to recognize pattern. Uh, what am I what am I saying? Um, you need to be able to know if the the market is in downtrend or the market is ranging or the market is in uptrend. So let me show you pretty much what I'm talking about. Uh, let me open the trading view. This is trading view. Okay, I recommend that you have an account on trading view. Okay, that will help you to help you a lot. Okay, it might just be a free account. And if you have the financial means, I encourage I want to encourage you to try and uh, join their monthly subscription. So let let's have a look at. Um, Bitcoin charts, for instance. So, I want to show you the Bitcoin charts, and um, if you change, if you switch this over to, uh, let me say, uh, let me remove all of these lines. Okay, let me remove all of these lines, so they can have a better view of the charts. Okay, so you need to be able to recognize the trend pattern. Okay, the trend pattern. So for like several days now, this is one day candlestick as you can see. So if you look at this, um, let me pull out this um, trend. Okay, if you look at this, it has really been an uptrend, you know, for like a lot of days right now, like more than 20 days, it's been an it's been an uptrend. So and since it is on uptrend you must be able to make a decision based on this fact like um look at this trend this is one um support another support is right here another support is right here so um possibly you know that the bitcoin has been finding support around this line so if you extend this upward okay you should be able to know you know the possible movement of bitcoin that is a trend you know based on the one day candlestick pattern a trend has been sets okay is trade as so but if you are using like a one a, a weekly candle it's a different ball game entirely all right so and that is a trend let me show you another one real quick uh let's go to tron let's check out tron um trx usdt um crypto all right so let's check out tron okay if you look at this <coughs> for the past um 20 days or more than that it's been ranging okay it's been ranging um let me let me show you let me show what i'm talking about you know this is a ranging market okay look at this it's been ranging okay it's been finding like resistance around that point okay um if you look at this also okay it's been ranging for the past few days okay always finding resistance around um, 0 0.73 you know 72 you know and 0, 0. Um, 0.064 here about okay so it's been ranging. so that is the pattern all right so you need to understand the uh, the the pattern so well that is one of those that makes you a very good um, trader so for someone who understands this pattern all you need to do is just to make sure that at this point you are always shorting strong at this point okay so it's, it gives you confidence to short strong at 0 0.7 at 0 0.072 all right 
at 0 0.7. So once this upper channel is broken, you should definitely know you should definitely know that based on this one hour candlestick, there is a breakout. Okay, and there's a breakout. So you have to go back, you have to you have to sit back, relax, you know, evaluate your trade and understand the new pattern. Allow the new, allow the new pattern to form to know, okay, um, this is going to be uptrend, and it's possible that this lower channel could be broken, I you know that that's going to be like a downtrend for that. Okay, so the pattern is your friend, you know, make sure that you recognize the pattern as fast as possible. Uh, you need to have a discernment um, skill, like a discernment skill is when people are saying that this particular crypto project is going to skyrocket in value, the next um, six months, okay, and there's been a lot of noise all around the world. A lot, a lot, a lot of girls on, on the internet, a lot of YouTubers are talking about it. A lot of um, guys on um, Twitter they are always talking about this project. Then you should be able to use a design to look, look at something that people are not talking about. What is not obvious about the project, okay? So you must be able to, I know, take a look at that. You know, like some, in you know, the most times in cryptocurrency world. Okay, in as much as it is good to follow trend, you know, when the trend is clear on the charts. But there is something that's gonna save you a lot, is thinking in a reverse direction. All right. Uh, when people are saying you should that um there is the market is extremely bullish and you can go to hundred thousand Bitcoin, you know, hundred thousand dollar per Bitcoin, um ten thousand dollar per Ethereum, that is possibly that that's what that's possibly the time that you start thinking of building your short position in the market okay so that is applying your discernment that is quite important so be skeptical like i said you know be skeptical don't just um don't just follow the news you know this could be paid for okay I, i've been to a crypto industry for the past six years now so i know that uh bloggers can be paid you know to put in good words for crypto projects um, there could be news articles about it, seeing a bunch of good stuff about the project. There could be videos on YouTube that are paid for, like promotional videos, uh, like inf influencers on YouTube that have tons and tons of um, subscribers. So projects can pay them. You know, they pay them. It's not, as if they, it's not as if they can pay them. They pay these guys to, you know, to make videos, you know, and promote so those projects. Also on Twitter, okay, a lot of Twitter influencers in crypto space they are paid to talk about NFT. Talk about DeFi product. To talk about uh, um, a blockchain project. So they are usually paid in thousands of dollars to talk about this project. So always look closely. Be skeptical. Like don't just follow everything that you see. Like okay, um, this influencer is talking about this. I think I, I think it's time to buy. Okay. So what are, what are thinking of buying? The influencer that is talking about the project may actually be selling at that point. All right. So you need to be careful about this. Okay. Uh, you need to be able to adapt, you know, just like you have a chameleon, you know, having different colors depending on his environment, trying to um, deceive the prey that, that may want to attack it, okay? So you need to be able to adapt in the crypto market, okay? Um, the market will not always pump all the time, okay? Don't be bullish every time. It doesn't make much sense. Once you notice that there is a general sentiment, like, okay, the market is pumping so hard, it's pumping so hard, and um, there is a new downtrend. The best thing for you is to adapt to that new trend, okay? Then start shorting the market. You can short the market for three months successfully if that's the new trend, okay? So it is wrong to be always bullish, like, okay, I'm expecting the market to go up. You know, it's not always up, you know, it's not up only, okay? The market is always going up all the time. So if there is a ranging market, leverage on the ranging market and make money for yourself if the market is bullish okay be bullish if market is bearish be bearish okay so just know that you go back to your charts and be sure of the new market direction before you make a position on the market okay so watch watch the volume look at the volume right here the volume has always been the same okay there, there's a bunch of information right here okay so the moment that the volume is above this level Okay, what do you expect? There will be like either massive pump or massive dump on Trump. That is the general outlook. Okay, so you should be careful of this. Okay, make sure that you are always adapting to the new change in the market. Okay, um, you need to be able to have a personal evaluation. Okay, what am I saying? Be able to have a journal, like a crypto journal that you can use to evaluate 
to evaluate your you know your trading don't just trade blindly you know, like personally i have like a, a notepad like a physical notepad not a digital notepad so on that notepad i just done a bunch of mistakes i've made a bunch of um successful trades i've made so those you know they not they, they, they the journal helps you to determine if you are actually hitting the, your target or not okay um i don't want to waste much of your time i will have shown you like an express uh, excel special that you can use to journal your trading okay journal your trading and that is going to help you a lot always evaluate you know by doing personal evaluation you are getting a feedback you know uh, whether it is positive feedback or negative feedback a feedback is always valuable so make sure that you are always doing personal evaluation for yourself okay then al also try as much as possible to compartmentalize okay what am i saying um when you have profits separate your profit from capital that is a bunch of mistakes that people make you know the acts the acts of taking profits is a skill on its own <laughs> yeah i know what i'm saying it's a skill on its own because i've seen quite a number of newbies a lot of new traders even some expert traders are falling um, victim of this when they have a capital of let me say like a um, hundred thousand dollars in the market and uh, they make a profit of five thousand seven thousand dollars they try they attempted to compound all right they attempted to compound because you know crypto trading is is like a war okay it's like a war when you win at any point that way you win in the war okay all the proceeds that comes to that war you gather them okay and send them back to your own country okay because you're in a battleground you know you're in a battlefield okay so always learn to see crypto trading like a war crypto trading is different from crypto investing so always learn to see crypto trading like a war like a full-time war a full-blown war okay so compartmentalize it every time you're making profit take out the profit you know into a separate wallet okay take out the profit into a separate wallet it helps your psychology like okay imagine that you you deposited like uh ten thousand dollars on exchange and when you made that deposit you're able to make um, um like where and ten dollar or a ten thousand dollar profit after like some months okay because you now have more than 100 percent of your deposit in a separate wallet it gives you that psychological improvement you know that that's that psychological advantage over other traders because at that point you can now be assured that the money that you're trading with on exchange is no longer your money it is the um the what's it called the house money okay for those who are into gambling you know that uh, the house money is whatever money that you that you win you know as a sort of betting or gambling okay or lottery that is the house money so you know that when you are trading with house money the the the, the, the risk you can take more risk because you are trading with house money okay and then you can make better decision like your decision you can have more clarity and make better decision so there is no fear you know the, the fear level in you is quite low so you don't panic sell you don't panic buy you know so because you are trading with the house money so it's going to help you a lot it's going to help you a lot so then make sure that you stay disciplined okay stay disciplined you know um it is people always um, tell others in crypto that okay you have to be disciplined you have to um stay true to your strategy you have to restrict yourself to your strategy and use that strategy to the last okay so it is really simple to say but it's hard to practice okay and um, there are some times that you, you are trying to stay so disciplined on whatever thing you believe in or whatever strategy or whatever strategy you are using or method or method that you are using in the crypto world so uh sometimes you might def you might default okay you may just turn against your own belief your own self strategy okay so but make sure that more than 80 percent of time you are always you know sticking to your game okay be disciplined follow your trading plan to the core okay then build a mastermind you know an example of mastermind is when you belong to a group of traders because there's a saying that iron will sharpen iron right you cannot use bamboo bamboo wood or a plank to sharpen iron it doesn't work like that so make sure that you belong to a, a mastermind it could be a group of three people four people five people and that's pretty much okay so when you are when you belong to that group then you have all it takes okay you have all it takes you know to sharpen each other you can review you can send your trades to them in the group you can review your trading plan you know 
and formulate a better idea over time that can help you to stay profit to you know to, to, to be profitable on the long run so have, have a mastermind so look for a mastermind and join if you don't have that or you should build your own mastermind and invite your friends to be a part of such mastermind group okay that's bro, that's gonna help a lot you know i've been there i know how this thing works i've been a, i've been a member of a few master group in, in the crypto world and it has really been helpful okay so you can try that also i recommend that so um <laughs> it's gonna look like a very funny thing to say that you guys should cash out okay cashing out is uh an extra skill you know reward yourself learn to enjoy the proceed of your sweat learn to enjoy the process of your effort okay so it makes sense to withdraw some um crypto to your bank account convert them to cash or whatever thing that you are comfortable with then go out there you know take out you know go out with your family or go alone and enjoy have fun enjoy your money enjoy your phone okay so it's going to help you a lot by the time you go back to trading you are going to feel extremely refreshed you know extremely refreshed so it's going to help your trading psychology okay it's going to help your trading psychology so um in conclusion okay stick to your game Follow all of these skills, okay? And if you are going to need these um, slides that I used in uh, this um, tutorial, this YouTube video tutorial, let me know in the comment box. I can share this with you. I can send this to your email, okay? Or you can join the Crypto Niche um, group on Telegram, okay? Be a part of the community on Telegram and request for this material. I'm going to share the material with you, right? So you can use this to teach your community. Or you can also use this to like a, like a reference material they can use for yourself personally all right so make sure that you follow all of these rules accordingly you know and i wish you success in your trading career okay also don't forget to um, subscribe to the channel okay um share this video with your friends like this video you know make a comment down below let me know what you think about the video and about this um strategy i'm teaching you about this new skill i'm teaching you about the skill let me know what you think about it in the comment box and i will be glad to reply your comment as fast as possible share with your friends like the video so that more people are going to be able to you know watch the video and benefit from it so by doing that you are doing good you know you're actually helping others okay by liking the video i like a bunch of videos on youtube because i know that if i like that video youtube algorithm will show it to more people okay and by doing that i'm actually helping more people in my own way all right so that's pretty much on how you can become a successful trader by following all of these skills all right don't forget recognize the pattern okay use your discernment be skeptical you know all the time and um adopt you know adapt very fast okay adapt very fast have a, you know have a personal evaluation for yourself compartmentalize you know stay disciplined you know that is really really important stay disciplined and um make sure that you have a mastermind and after that then you must try and cash out okay so i use this presentation on hobby to teach people on hobby because i'm, I'm a live streamer on hobby as a key opinion leader ambassador on the platform so um you can also follow me on you can follow me on twitter okay or jenny underscore your bad twitter you can also search for me on uh, on instagram still jenny underscore your so i love you guys and have a great day bye for now